Hi everyone, today is Monday, August 12, 2013. Uh, I'm at my front yard and what you're looking at here are my okra and I'm picking some of my okra and some uh, lemon tomato and some cherry tomato. Uh, but anyway, I want to show you guys something, something very special, well, at least to me, I think it's very special. And let me see if I can coax it out, okay? What you guys see here? Come on, baby. Let's see if I can get it out to my hand here and show you guys this very special creature here. You know what that is? This, it's a praying mantis. One of the beneficial insect here. I thought I would never seen this animal in my yard, or at least in California. Uh, this is a great animal to have in your yard. They control a lot of uh, little other uh, insects, uh, flies, and so and so. And in order to encourage them, um, the first thing you have to do is do not spray any chemical inse uh, uh, insecticide. And also grow a lot of different diversity of plant to encourage diversity. Um, so and so. But therefore, you, you will encourage ladybugs, lizard. Okay, little bit. Go ahead. Come on. Go. See how she jumped? This really reminded me when I was a kid in a, in a foreign country where every summer I would go out to my uh, to outside and there would be hundreds of these little tiny animal a hatch, hatchling. Uh, they hatch from the cocoon eggs that, that uh, from the tree, and I would love to pick them up and play with them. Uh, of course, only during the, the warm season they would come out, they would hatch, and they make such a beautiful creature. The tiny one is really cute to me. They're really extraordinary the way they stand, uh, the way they claws, just like a, like they're praying. That's why they call them praying mantis. But this guy here is such a unique creature here. Uh, when so when I spot this guy in my garden, it's really a, such a happy moment for me. And like I say, remind me when I was a child. Okay, so I will let him go. And so you too can have a good uh, productive garden uh, if you do it naturally, uh, organically, and all these insects and all this vegetable will come alive and everything will be in harmony with each other. So therefore, no spray. Thank you for watching. Please subscribe to my video.